Well, good morning to you and welcome back. We're seeing lots of cloud cover outside on our cameras this morning. We're slowly going to start to see a lot of that drizzle as well as that cloud cover start to dissipate as we head into the afternoon. Currently, we're still pretty cloudy and we're seeing a lot of that drizzle across the region. 41 degrees out there, but our feels like temperatures are pretty chilly. Man, many of us still sitting in those 30s, so it feels pretty cool. Make sure to bundle up. Winds pushing in from the south, which is a good sign. That will start to infuse our region with some of that warmer air. When it comes to our current temperatures, many of us still sitting in those mid to upper 30s will slowly start to pop into those 40s later this afternoon with the addition of that sunshine and those stronger southerly winds. So southerly winds really will be the key to what pushes us into those warmer temperatures, not only today, but also headed into to the weekend. When it comes to winds, many of us are anywhere between about 5 to 15, a little bit stronger along the lakeshore. Many of our lakeshore communities in the teens, but with individual gusts in the upper teens as well as the 20s. So if you haven't already made sure that all of your Halloween decorations are tied down, it's probably the time to do so. Throughout the rest of today, we'll continue to see a lot of these rain showers starting to sprinkle on out of here. Luckily, we are not seeing snow, thank goodness, but we are, however, seeing some of this rain. It does look like the rain is set to start to taper off. We are seeing some of these um, showers still developing over the lake, but later this afternoon, as those clouds begin to clear, we'll start to see a lot of that dying out. We're going to see that here on future track. A lot of it dying out throughout the rest of today. Winds really start starting to ramp up, especially from the south, headed into our Friday. As you can see, mostly clear skies headed into our Friday. That'll be really nice when it comes to our temperatures and those southerly winds will just continue to push that warmer air from the southern states into our region, which will then bump us not only into the 50s and the 60s, but even the 70s by the weekend. A couple of passing clouds headed into the weekend, but overall mostly clear skies. For today, temperatures will rise into the 50s. 50 exactly will be our high. We'll start to see those decreasing clouds later today. A lot of those showers and sprinkles and even some drizzle will start to taper off later this afternoon. Our winds will continue to push in from the west and the southwest at about 5 to 10 miles an hour. Tonight, those winds will really start to die out. We'll see decreasing clouds almost completely, mostly clear skies. Still pretty chilly though. Low temperatures overnight dipping into the 30s. 34 will be Grand Rapids low. We'll see those temperatures though really starting to warm up headed into the weekend. We're looking at 63 by Friday, mostly sunny skies, which we can see on future track. We'll continue to stay into the 70s headed into the weekend. It's almost like early fall, mostly sunny skies on Saturday, and then we'll start to see some cloud development headed into our Sunday. By Monday, we have a nice low pressure system bringing in the chance for some evening showers on Monday. Those look to be a little bit more widespread by Tuesday. We'll start to see those temperatures slipping back down into the 60s by Tuesday and then back down into the 50s by about Wednesday. Showers, though, should start to taper off by Wednesday of next week. Another thing to point out is by the end of next week, we'll fall back into those mid 50 degree temperatures, which tends to be the average toward the end of October. So a little bit warmer that we can expect this weekend, but we'll fall right back into average.